Hello, my Aries, my sexy Aries. How are you guys? All right, I hope you guys been doing great. I know you have been. All right. All right, and welcome to my new viewers that have stopped in to view my channels. Welcome, 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 welcome. Please subscribe before you leave. Hit the little red button on the bottom. Thank you. I really appreciate it. And I really appreciate my um, Aries subscribers that have already subscribed. I really appreciate you guys, and I thank you so much. All right. I thank you. All right. Love you guys. Okay, so this is a reading on your stability, your finances, and your growth. Okay, you guys, it may resonate and it may not. Okay, if it doesn't, maybe next time, you guys. All right, so here we go. Holy Spirit, show us Aries energy concerning their stability, finances, and growth. Holy Spirit, show us Aries energy concerning their stability, finances, and growth. Show us Aries energy. Okay. Hmm. You got five cards. Okay. I'll keep all five. I see. <clears throat> Concerning this, I only use four. Three or four. Okay. So the hair font card. Okay. We have. So that may be some restrictions. Okay. It could be a... um. Public job, government, um, federal job, counseling, teacher. Okay. Hair front card. Okay. Nine of Pentacles. Take your time. Think. Or this is your energy. The Virgo card. Nine of Pentacles. Lowest card in the deck. Um, you're thinking in a situation. Or you're being told to think before you move. Think very careful. Use your wisdom. Think wisely. Be wise. Make a make the right decision. Think about the decision you're about to make. Okay. So the chariot card. Success. Or you may have to travel somewhere concerning your stability. It may cause you to have to travel. But it's, it's a success. This is a success card too as well. Okay. Or it might entail you to have the type of stability you're able to take trips. Or it might be the type of job that you have to um, travel for that job. Business type job. And they, they fly you out. Okay. And you handle your business. Okay. King of Wands. Innerly satisfied. The Aries. This is you, Aries. Wow. Hold on to your power. Three of Pentacles. Working hard at building a business, a creation, something. You're working hard at it. Organization. You're working hard, whatever it is. You're building. Okay, so we're going to start with the hair font card, okay? Holy Spirit, clarify this hair font card. Wow, you guys are ready. Stability, King of Pentacles. So this hair phone card is saying there may be some, some type of um, restrictions that's going to come with your stability. So you get your stability. So there's going to be some type of restrictions when it comes to your stability. Or you're going through that now, okay? Holy Spirit, clarify this King of Pentacles. So whatever you're doing now, um, it's some type of restrictions. It's causing your you to have to be restricted concerning your stability, okay? Whatever it, is, whatever it is you're doing now, okay? So you have to be careful with what you spend, how you spend, you know. You have to save. Holy Spirit, clarify the King of Pentacles. Clarify the King of Pentacles and Aries energy concerning their stability, finances, and growth, Holy Spirit. Clarify this King of Pentacles concerning Aries 
Finances, stability and growth, Holy Spirit. Clarify the King of Pentacles. Oh, that's too many cards. Clarify the King of Pentacles and Aries energy, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay, there we go. So you're not letting anybody know this. This is a secret. You don't want to share this restrictiveness that you have concerning your stability. So you might be faking it until you make it, in other words. Okay? Yeah. You're not letting anybody know that you have to save. You have to be careful with your finances. Or you're not carrying on like you do have to save. You just like you have the greatest job in the world. You're carrying on like you have it. But really, in reality, you have to be restrictive. You know this, okay? But you're not sharing it with anybody. You don't want anybody to know this. Holy Spirit, clarify the moon card and Aries energy concerning their stability, finance, and security. Clarify, Holy Spirit, the moon card. Okay, yeah. The lover's card. So, you may feel like you may need help. Lover's card. Teamwork. Okay? You might be in a relationship where you feel that this, the person that you're with, they're not helping like they should. So, you, you, you want some teamwork. So, you can have the stability that you need. Okay? And this person may be a Gemini, Aries. Okay? Or you're thinking about a person that's a Gemini that you believe that can bring you, can bring you stability. That you're thinking about um, going into a relation with or trying to build a relationship with. So you can have the stability that you want in your life. And you know this person can do that for you. Okay? So it's either or. Alright? So now we're going to move on. The Knight of Pentacles. Okay? And you're being told... You're going to have to think, strategize, and plan when it comes to the stability that you want. Take your time. Don't rush into nothing, to anything. So maybe this person that you're tr thinking of bringing on, getting into this relationship with for stability, you need to slow down. Think about it before you do it. Okay? Take your time. Make sure you're making the right decision on this person. That you that you think can bring you stability, okay? Holy Spirit, clarify this Knight of Pentacles and Aries energy. Clarify this Knight of Pentacles and Aries energy concerning, the, okay? Yeah. So you might be tired of working hard. You're ready to bring someone on because you're tired of working hard over time. So, right now, you, you're doing something where you're working at nights, working overtime, and you, you're tired of that. So, you're ready to bring somebody on, okay? And you want this relationship with this person for stability, and you want a victory in that, okay? And you're thinking, planning, strategizing how to do that, but take your time, okay? Make sure you're making the right decision. Seven of Cups. There you go. You're thinking of options. How you can go about getting the stability you want. Okay. Holy Spirit, clarify. Yeah, so you, you're you thinking of the options. Somebody you can bring on your team to make your st increase your stability. <laughs> Alright, but take your time. The Knight of Pentacles. Take your time. Make sure you're making the right decision about this person. Make sure they are going to be able to help you. Bring you the stability. Make sure. You know. And make sure you love the person as well. Because love is needed. Okay. Because you don't want to be unhappy with someone. Just because you want stability. You know. And you guys be like roommates. Alright. Alright. The chariot card. Okay. This stability. Um, you may have to travel. Okay. You might have to travel back and forth with this stability that's coming in, okay?
Or you might have to travel back and forth for this person that you want to be in your life for stability purpose. They're at a distance from you. And you have to travel to get to this person. You might have to move. You might have to move. You might have to make a move to be with this person. The chariot card. That's the card of moving. You may be moved or you might be have it on your mind. You're thinking about it, okay? So, yeah. And this is the success card. So, if you make that move, it will be a success. Holy Spirit, clarify the chariot card. And Aries energy concerning their stability. Okay, King of Cups. Okay, so this has something to do with emotions. So you're, be rational. This is a, be rational, think rationally. Make sure this is what you want to do. That's what it's saying. Make a rational decision on making this move. When you decide to make this move, be rational. Make sure this is what you want. Make sure this is what you want to do. Okay, all right. But this is showing that, that this will be, bring you stability the the six of pentacles windfall of money so it's shown when you do this move it will benefit you the six of pentacles you will have an increase in your finances when you make this move it will be a success the six of pentacles wow okay holy spirit clarify this six of pentacles in aries energy concerning their finances Stability and their growth, Holy Spirit. So, yeah. So, yeah, you will grow. You will have growth in your finances. Look, look at this. Wow. And this will be a success and a new beginning that grow. When you make this move, when you move this distance with this person. Think rationally. Make sure you're making the right decision. But it's telling you the Six of Pentacles. It will benefit your growth when you make this move. You will have a new beginning in growth. Okay? Alright, so this is you, Aries. This this, um, this move you want to make to this person, this person innerly satisfies you. This person is going to bring you the stability that you want. Okay? In your future. And this is... Or where you're at. You're innerly satisfied already. So maybe that's why you're... <laughs> you might be thinking. They're telling you to think rationally because this job is innerly satisfies you where you're at already. But you know, to get the stability you want, you have to move. You have to make a move towards this person. You have to move into them. All right? But you're stagnant right now. Okay? When it comes to your, you're innerly satisfied, but you're stagnant on what to do. You're trying to decide what to do. You're trying to make a decision. The hangman. Okay? Whether to move or to stay at a job that you know you're in, innerly satisfied with already or make this move that's going to bring you more growth in finances and stability okay so you have to make a decision you have to believe holy spirit clarify the hangman and aries energy concerning their yeah you're juggling with the idea of, of moving so you could be with this person that you know could give you stability and growth in your finances. You're juggling with that idea. Maybe you guys have spoken on it, okay? And you're juggling with the idea of it now. Holy Spirit, clarify the two of pentacles and Aries energy concerning their stability. Yeah. And it may be with the Leo or it's a situation where you're going to have to be strong. Use your strength in, Okay? It's saying. But this person may be a Leo, whoever this resonates with. If it resonates, it's a Leo person, okay? That you're thinking about moving to. 
All right. So three of pentacles. So you're working hard at building. Something. A business. A creation of some sort. Or this relationship with this um, Gemini Leo person. Because it may be a Gemini Leo, okay? Or it could resonate with two different people. So one could be a Gemini Leo. It don't, you really don't have to get stuck on the sign, okay? And it could reverse. Energies could reverse. This could be you. I mean, the other person, okay? Somebody you're in a relationship with. Or somebody that you know that's in your energy. Holy Spirit, clarify this three of pentacles. Okay, so you're trying, you're working hard at coming up with creative ideas, maybe how to go about being with this person, getting your stability with this person. Holy Spirit, clarify the page of pentacles. This person that you know that can bring you growth in your finances. Increase your finances. Holy Spirit, clarify the page of cups. Yeah. Oh, so you, you yeah, you're trying to come up with creative ideas. Yeah. How to offer, make an offer to this person. Come into this Knight of Cups. This is you, Aries. You're trying to, you're working hard at coming up with creative ideas. How to offer this person that you know could give you stability and growth. How to offer them your love. You're trying to come up with creative ideas. How to offer your love to this person. Holy Spirit, clarify the Knight of Cups. Clarify the Knight of Cups and Aries energy. Concern their stability, finances. This has you in solitude to yourself. You know, you might spend a lot of time to yourself thinking. Trying to make a decision. Whether to move towards them and how to offer your love to them. So you guys can move forward. Alright? So I wish you luck with that, Aries. Yes, I hear you talking. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -mm -mm. Makes me happy. Yes, that you're thinking about it. All right. So um, this is the end of your read, guys. I hope you enjoy um, Aries. Who's ever viewing? Please subscribe. Hit that bottom corner. Red word. Subscribe. Hit it. Click on it. Whatever you got to do. Step on it. Subscribe to me, you guys. I really would love to have you. Thank you very much. You guys have a great night. Love, peace, and happiness. And I'm out. Until next time, stay tuned, you guys.